Your Homelink Universal Transceiver's control buttons are located along the bottom of your rearview mirror. The system can consolidate the functions of various individual handheld transmitters to replace devices that operate garage doors, gates, lights, or security alarms. Homelink is powered by your Infinity Vehicle's battery and requires no other power source. Remember that you'll need all of your handheld transmitters, such as your garage door opener, to successfully program Homelink. To get started, press and hold one of the Homelink buttons for approximately 10 seconds. When the indicator light begins to illuminate, release the button. Now you're ready to program. To begin programming, position the handheld transmitter 2 to 8 inches away from the Homelink surface. Now, press and hold the handheld transmitter button until the indicator light turns green. When the indicator light illuminates green, the button may be released. The light indicates that the device has been successfully programmed. If the indicator lamp lights up red, repeat the programming procedure for the corresponding button on the rearview mirror. When doing so, vary the distance between the handheld transmitter and the rearview mirror. If the garage door system uses a rolling code, you will also have to synchronize the garage door system with the integrated garage door opener in the rearview mirror. To do this, turn the ignition to the on position, leave the vehicle and press this programming button. Get into the vehicle and press the previously programmed button on the home link until the garage door closes. This last step must be performed within 30 seconds of pushing the programming button on the door drive unit. If you have any questions or are having difficulty programming your Homelink buttons, please refer to the Homelink website at www.homelink.com or call 1-800-355-3515. Please see your owner's manual for important safety information, system limitations, and additional operating and feature information.